So in this last video, we're going to go through what the SAM design needs to have in order for it to work. Um, first off, the technical shaft. Keep the distance uh, of the shower and the toilet as small as possible between it and the shower and the, and the shaft so that you can keep the length of the drains uh, as short as possible and guarantee the right gradient and runoff of the, the drain pipe. Um, Leaving from the technical risers of the shaft, you want to have a clear path for the sanitary piping running along the bottom so that you can service this sink and the sink in the bathroom. Important to note that sanitary piping cannot go past a door. So keep this in mind when you are designing the SAM that the, the sanitary or the, the plumbing, the, the sink and, and anything else that needs to be supplied with, with running water um, is placed before a door. Um, similar with the cornice, so it run along, runs along the top. The ventilation, electricity wiring, and the heating runs all along the, the top cornice. So you want to make sure that there's a clear path for those utilities to run along the top so you can service all the different rooms. Each room has one convector. So in a, in a bedroom, you'll also pl place a, a, a convector. In the living room, you have a, you have a large convector here. Um, ventilation systems, if you're working with a ventilation system C, uh, there will only be extraction points. So the extraction point is here above the kitchen, above the uh, extraction fan and somewhere in the bathroom, probably close to the shower right here. And if you have a system D, um, you will have both extraction points and inflow points. So the inflow uh, or the influx of, of fresh air will be where we place our convector so that it gets blown through the heating element and into the living space. And obviously the extraction points will be kept in the same positions above here in the, in the uh, extraction fan and near the shower. So if you have all those points kind of checked off, then the SAM should work. Um, again, if you have any other questions, don't hesitate to get in touch with us or go look at the other tutorials or send us a mail, give us a call. We're happy to help.